today I'm showcasing a 2002 65 foot Hatteras Sport Fisher open bridge with a full tower. Wait till you see this boat in exceptional condition. It needs nothing. It's almost turnkey and ready to go. So here is this magnificent Hatteras 65 open bridge sport fisher with a full tower. As you can see, it's a spectacular tower. Radar in the middle deck, the satellite in the upper deck, crow's nest on top, outriggers, beautifully polished aluminum uh, tower. It's just a gorgeous setup. And the bridge, the helm, is roomy and complete. Here's your cockpit with a great fighting chair. There's a cover for the fighting chair. This is a real fishing machine. It's got all the equipment you need. It's got ice boxes. It's got refrigerators. It's got fish boxes. It's got in-floor storage. It's got bait tanks. This is really a well-equipped boat. And for a fisherman, uh, you just really can't do any better than get this heavy, strong, fast Hatteras 65. As you can see, there is a set of stern controls, and there they are, a little pop-out cabinet, and they're complete. You can drive the boat from here. And then there's a barbecue, a beautiful barbecue, along with um, a nice refrigerator. This is the access to the engine room right here, as you can see. And then uh, we have some, oh, this is a uh, bait tank. You can see the water into the bait tank and next to it is a freezer very cold freezer setup and then on deck of course is your fighting chair it's a beautiful elaborate fighting chair with pole holders behind here's your ice box for fish and it's making ice there you go it works perfectly let's make some ice and of course there's port and starboard power hookups and hose hookups this is your hard top over your cockpit. It's got spotlights. It's got a mister. It's got rocket launchers. It's got a rear facing camera. Uh, here's your water going into your bay tank. And as you walk forward on the deck, it's an open deck so you can fish all the way around. Great anchoring system and no windows in the salon so you can take heavy seas and not worry about breaking windows. And there's a shot from the middle deck looking down on your cockpit your helm station has twin seats with covers and of course there's guest seats there's all kinds of refrigerator boxes up here there's overhead electronics there's seating forward all the way around it's a wraparound forward seating area with beautiful uh, isinglass beautiful zippers everything's in great shape near new condition and i'm showing you a complete panoramic shot of it all And then your cockpit is a well-equipped cockpit, lots and lots of electronics. As you see, they're fired up, and there's color depth sounders, there's radar and chart plotters and autopilots, bow thrusters, uh, a couple VHF radios, uh, there's a, a power spotlight, there's stereo. I mean, everything you need is here. There's your engine control panel and your fuses. Lots of Furuno equipment. Here's your Caterpillar enunciator panels and your water temperature. And you've got a warning system also on board. Your bow thruster. There's your mid deck open away array radar. It's a Furuno. And uh, your, your canister is there. It's just been serviced, it's in perfect condition. There's your ladder up to the crow's nest, which I did climb up. There's your outriggers. Incredible condition, beautifully serviced, ready to fish, as you can see. And then up in the crow's nest, you got a helm, you got your bow thrust, you got your engine controls. Look at the view from on top. Oh my, this is all the way up. It's a hard top over the crow's nest. And of course, the aluminum is in spectacular condition. You have a lean back uh, pad. Then walking into the salon, it's a big, roomy, comfortable salon, virtually flawless. I think there's a small stain on the couch, and that's about it. 
but typical Hatteras has got a monstrous U-shaped granite countered galley. I mean, you could really cook up a great meal for your 10 best friends here. Then seat your 10 best friends at the dining table next to it. And it's got a granite counter also. These are all upgrades and in beautiful condition. The light granite really works. There's your heat teak and holly galley floor. You've got two sets of sub-zero refrigerator and freezers with cruising locks on the door. And you do have a uh, washing machine right here. And then your salon, of course, is a big L-shaped couch, big table, couple easy chairs, more counters, um, really a nice setup, beautiful setup. Your power panel is very elaborate, very complete in sections. As you can see, you've got your DC side and your AC side. It's all well marked. It's not confusing. It's not cluttered. It's made for business. And you can really start up your boat, shut it down with ease. So these are some great salon interior spaces from the galley to the guest seating. Um, really have a good time with your friends and family and fishing buddies. And then the stairs downstairs to the accommodations. Beautiful uh, woodwork on the walls, by the way. And it's a very wide walkway down. As you get down to the bottom, you have your first set of Pullman upper and lower in a stateroom. And adjacent to that, there's a head in the shower and a mechanical room. It's a three-quarter walk-in mechanical room. And as you can see, all your, uh, your AC equipment is in here. Your cruise air AC equipment, your chillers. Uh, there's a full-size refrigerator freezer also in there. And then in, behind the shower in the guest salon, you enter the engine room. See if it got a cockpit and an interior entrance into the engine room. And look at that teak and holly floor in your engine room. Have you ever seen that before? It's a beautiful, spotless engine room. It's hard to find a flaw with the engine room. You look at the bilge and it's virtually clean, just one little spot of oil and that's it. But back into the guest bathroom, you can see air conditioning and a vacuum flush and again a granite countered sink and of course a, uh, a filters holding rack or a pantry, whichever you want to make it. There's your separate washer and dryer set up behind doors. And then your second stateroom is upper and lower Pullman. And it's got its own head off to the side. There's entering the head. And that's also a hallway head for guests. But it's got beautiful, beautiful granite counters. Absolutely gorgeous. A full stand-up shower with a sliding door. No curtains here. Antique and holly floors. And this is your uh, master stateroom, three full walk around, beautiful setup, and lots of cabinets, lots of storage. There's a TV set in there, and then there's its own head again with teak and holly floor. This one has a tub. It's a Hatteras 65 with a shower tub. Just lean back, grab a glass of wine, enjoy your tub. But it's got the same gorgeous granite counters with vacuum flush head. Now forward is your second master or VIP forward. Same treatment as before, lots of storage, beautiful queen size bed. Got its own in-room bathroom connected to, uh, to it through the hallway, the hallway head. So there you go. Hatteras 65.